Hello everyone, in this video let us solve this question. So we have a plus 2ab plus b is equal to 40 and here or to solve for the value of a and b. To solve this solution, solution, so we have a plus 2ab plus b, this equals 40. Now factorize out 2a from this, we have 2a into bracket 1 over 2 plus b then we have plus b this equals 40 with this we're going to add 1 over 2 to the left hand side and the right hand side of the equation so this equation becomes 2a into bracket this can be written as b plus 1 over 2 then plus b then add 1 over 2 okay is equal to 40 then also had 1 over 2 so with this we have 2a into bracket b plus 1 over 2 then plus we can factorize out 1 from this we have 1 into bracket b plus 1 over 2 and this equals we can write 40 as 80 over 2 plus 1 over 2 and we have 2a into bracket b plus 1 over 2 then plus 1 into bracket b plus 1 over 2 and this equals 80 over 2 plus 1 over 2 the value is simply 81 over 2 so from this we have a common factor which is simply b plus 1 over 2 b plus 1 over 2 big 1 we have in bracket b plus 1 over 2 then multiplied by we have 2a and plus 1 2a plus 1 and this equals 81 over 2 at this junction we're going to multiply this equation by 2 multiply this by 2 so we're going to have 2 times b 2b plus 2 times 1 over 2 is 1 then this is being multiplied by 2a plus 1 and this equals 2 cancel 2, we have 81. So at this junction, we can rewrite this as in bracket 2a plus 1, then multiplied by 2b plus 1, and this equals 81. So at this junction, 81, 81 right here as a factor of 1 times 81. Okay, 81 times 1. 3 times 27, 27, 27 times 3, and 9 times 9. So these are the factors of 81. We have the first case, second case, third case, the fourth, and then the fifth case. Okay, so in this case right here, let's solve the first case. So for case 1, for case 1, we have in brackets, 2a plus 1 multiplied by 2b plus 1 this equals 81 will be written as 1 times 81 and this becomes 2a 2a plus 1 equals to 1 and we have 2b plus 1 equals to 81 so from here if we move plus 1 over to this other side we have 2a is equal to 1 minus 1 we have a is equal to 0 over 2 and a is equal to 0 okay good why for this case we have 2b is equal to move plus 1 over to the other side we have 81 minus 1 we have b is equal to 80 over 2 and b is equal to 14 so in this case the value of a and b okay a and b the value is equal to 0 comma 40 for the first case okay so why for the second case we have 81 times 1 so this equation becomes we have in brackets 2a first of all case 2 so we have in bracket 2a plus 1 then multiplied by 2b plus 1 equals 81 and for case 2 the value of 81 is 81 times 1 so this becomes we have in bracket 2a plus 1 multiplied by 2b plus 1 
and this equals 81 times 1. So with this, we have 2a plus 1 equals 281 and 2b plus 1 equals 1. From here, 2a is equal to move plus 1 to the other side. We have 81 minus 1 and 2a is equal to 80. So divide both sides by 2. A is equal to 80 over 2 and this equals 14. Okay, so we have solved the value of A as 40. Why for the value of B for this one? We have 2B plus 1 equals to 1. Move plus 1 to this other side. We have 2B is equal to 1 minus 1. We have 2B is equal to 0 over 2 over 2. The value of B is equal to 0. So in this case, the value of a comma b is equal to a is 40 while the value of b is 0 okay that is for case 2 now for the next case case 3 which is 3 times 27 so for the third case case 3 the equation which is in bracket 2a plus 1 multiplied by 2b plus 1 this equals 81 and in this case, 2a plus 1 multiplied by 2b plus 1 is equal to, for case 3, 81 has a factor of 3 times 27. So writing this down, we have 3 times 27. So this becomes 2a plus 1 equals to 3 and 2b plus 1 equals 27. From this, move plus 1 to this side. We have 2a is equal to 3 minus 1. And from here, we have the value of a to equal 2 over 2. a is equal to 1. And why for this equation, move plus 1 to this other side. We have 2b is equal to 27 minus 1. We have b is equal to 26 over 2. We have b is equal to 13. And the value of a and b, so in bracket a comma b, is equal to 1 comma 13 and this is for case 3 so for the next case case 4 that we have 27 times 3 so right here for case 4 case 4 the equation which is in bracket 2a plus 1 multiplied by 2b plus 1 equals 281 for case 4 we have 2a plus 1 multiplied by 2b plus 1 and this equals 81 then is for case 4 27 times 3 so we write down we write down 27 times 3 from here 2a plus 1 equals 27 and 2b plus 1 equals 3 so move plus 1 over to this side we have 2a is equal to 27 minus 1 we have a is equal to 26 over 2 and from here the value of a is equal to 13. Why for this equation move plus 1 to this other side we have 2b is equal to 3 minus 1 we have b is equal to 2 over 2 we have b is equal to 1 so the value of a and b a comma b is equal to a is 13 b is 1 good and that is for case 4 okay so for the next case we have case 5 9 times 9 so back to the equation we have this for case 5 right here for case 5 the equation is in brackets 2a plus 1 multiplied by 2b plus 1 this equals 81 with this we have in brackets 2a plus 1 multiplied by 2b plus 1 is equal to for case 5 81 is 9 times 9 so from here 2a plus 1 is equal to 9 and 2b plus 1 is equal to 9 so with this move plus 1 over to this side we have 2a is equal to 9 minus 1 the value of a is equal to 8 over 2 and with this the value of a is equal to 4 why from this equation we have 2b is equal to move plus 1 over to the other side we have 9 minus 1 we have b is equal to 8 over 2 and b is equal to 4 so with this we have the value 
of a comma b as 4 comma 4 okay so these are the values of a and b so collecting all the values of a and b together you have a comma b right the value is equal to we have the first one as 0 comma 14 then we have the next one as 40 comma 0 then we have the next one as 1 comma 13 the next one is 13 comma 1 the next one is 4 comma 4 and these are the values of a and b so with this i hope you all enjoyed the video do also like the video subscribe to this channel thanks for watching god bless you